Minister of State John Curl appeared in front of an Oireachtas Committee on January 27, 2010. And Anne Irwin, coordinator of the community workers' co-op, gave an immediate response. Uh, I think it was useful to a point. Uh, I think that the minister did say something new. He said that local arrangements between CDPs are what were CDPs and uh, partnership companies are now possible. Um, and I think that's an interesting development. That's a new development and it's one certainly to be capitalised on. Uh, one thing that wasn't really addressed though, and that is the inadequacies that are in the local and community development programme, because even if local arrangements are made and even if they are satisfactory in some areas, the programme that remains is still um, quite flawed and from our perspective certainly doesn't facilitate quality community work or good social inclusion work at local level. Okay, and uh, do you see scope for including volunteering in the new programme to the extent that you'd be pleased with? Uh, absolutely not. I think what is meant by that, if you look at the, I suppose the guidelines for the, the implementation of the new programme, one percent of the funding for each partnership is they are required to give one percent of their funding towards the volunteer centres and my concern or concern is that that is what is meant by the volunteering or the 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 uh, ways for for to get volunteers involved and we'd be very concerned that that's what he means by that because in our book that's not what we mean when we talk about volunteering we talk about activism we talk about participation we don't talk about volunteering the way i think the minister is referring to it can you name any good things about the new local and community development programme? I'd be very hard pushed to name good things about the new local and community development programme. From our perspective it's a diluted, weakened, watered down version of the local development social inclusion programme as it stands, which is the programme that the partnerships implement. From our perspective there's no room for quality community work, um, even though community is in the title, it certainly isn't in the implementation of it. Um, it isn't in the objectives and it isn't in, 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 in as, you, as you follow the, 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 the programme um, down the page it really isn't there so I, I'd actually kind of be hard pressed to find a positive in it I would like to see it rewritten and I don't think it would actually take much to strengthen it and to put the community the community development back central um, to the programme but I do think it certainly needs to be reworked. Can you end up with something that positive. will work? Um, I think without a huge deal of difficulty. What was very interesting about today, I think, was, and I think I think most of us involved in in this protest, um, in various different ways, would say that we're we know that changes need to be made. Um, we're not adverse to change. We're not adverse to reform. It's the process of the way that has been done. And I think if a bit of process and a bit of thought was put into it, we could certainly get a good program out uh, out of what we have, and we could certainly get good implementation. Um, systems okay. and structures out of it. Will the CDPs, do you think, come up with an alternative proposal? I think there's two things to be said about that. I think I know for a fact that some organisations and some areas have come up with alternative proposals. I also know that other areas and, and clusters are working on alternative proposals. And nationally? Um, nationally, the Community Workers Co-op is working on a proposal. Um, I mean, we've been, working, we've been working on this idea for quite a while and it's very difficult really to come up with a concrete proposal when you don't know the parameters. We now know the parameters and we're actually quite near there with an alternative proposal and the department know that because we've said it to them um, and if they've given the Centre for Effective Services with all its millions and all its resources um, that number of years, I think it was nearly two years to come up with an alternative programme or to come up with the original programme I think a small few weeks or a few months is not too much to ask for the community sector for with its lack, lack okay. of resources to come up with an alternative. Okay. Anna Irwin, Community Workers Club, thank you.